Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve an application error 10013. An attempt was made to access a socket in a way forbidden by its access permissions. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here guys on how to resolve it. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu. Type in services, best match, should come back with services. Go ahead and open that up. And now you want to go down to the internet connection sharing service. So just might need to scroll down a little bit here. And once you locate it, proceed to double click on that service. If the service status is set to running, you want to select the stop option and sort of type, click on the drop down and select disabled. Select apply. And OK, close out of here, open up the search menu and type in CMD, best match, should say command prompt, right click on it and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now you want to type in IP config, followed by a space, forward slash flush DNS, flush DNS, should all be one word, attach that forward slash out front. Hit enter on the keyboard, should come back with Windows IP configuration, successfully flush the DNS resolver cache. Now you want to type in NETSH space WinSock, W-I-N-S-O-C-K, space reset, once again exactly how you see it on my screen, and hit enter. Successfully reset the WinSock catalog, you must restart the computer in order to complete the reset. At this point, close out of here, and you want to restart your computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully, this point or issue has been resolved. And as always, thank you for watching. I do apologize to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.